hello and welcome back. This is a series of two videos and in the first one I'm going to show you how to create your white label site and you're going to need three things. So first off you're going to need a DNS uh, subdomain, you're going to need access to that DNS subdomain and you're going to need an active email address and uh, now we can go and start. So now let's get to it and I am going to show you first, uh, in our documentation we have explanations of every single thing that you need to configure beforehand. So uh, I'm going to scroll down a little bit and as I said before, you will have to configure your DNS beforehand and um, create an A record that points to our IP address or an A name or alias record to point to whitelabel.datacake.com. And once this is done, then we can jump directly to the platform and to your workspace. And your white label site is for now attached to your workspace. So wherever you create it, you are going to have the administration of the white label site and you are going to see the white label zone inside of, of the uh, left side menu. And when you click on add white label, again, repetitive, we need uh, these elements to create it. And uh, the most important things are these ones that are shown here. You need a name, you need a domain, you need an email from and an email name. So now I'm going to say that this one's going to be Teres White Label Site. And that's my domain. And that's my subdomain. My domain is teresavargasross.com and I created my subdomain iot.teresavargasross.com and my customers are going to be able to visit my white label site using that subdomain. Now I am going to give my own email address here and I'm going to give an email from name which is the name that's going to be displayed whenever my customers get emails from my white label site which can be notifications it can be reports also the invitations so I'm going to just give my name and I'm going to click on next and yeah now we come to the payment white label site completely alone costs 79 euros per month and if you get any of the packages, you're going to have it included in the package. So now I'm going to buy it. And uh, once this is done, it's created now. And you're going to see that uh, you can always change the name of your white label site. Uh, you also have logo and fav icon, which are these logos. And the fav icon is a little logo that appears next to the name on the tab on the uh, website and um, I prepared white label elements to be able to show you how it will look like. I'm going to upload a logo. Um, I had a couple of options and here you can upload your own logo, your own fab icon. And as you can see, we have a small preview of them. And now we also have really beautiful authent authentication screen layouts, which are, um, we have two options. We have a card layout and we also have a split uh, screen layout. I'm going to show you both so that you can see uh, what exactly that means. And I prepared a background photo. It can be your logo. It can be a nice colorful background. It can be a only white. Uh, background you can decide how you want that to look like i'm going to upload this and now you're going to see how your login screen or authentication screen is going to look like if you select the split screen layout the background photo that i just uploaded is going to be on the right side of the screen and if you select the card layout it's going to be all over the background and in the middle you're going to have the little area where your users can enter email and password. I prefer personally this pre uh, split screen layout. It's really beautiful with this uh, particular background image. 
You can also upload your own link uh, to terms of service and your own link to privacy policy. Those are important if, in case that you want your customers to have your information. In this case, I'm just going to leave the data cake ones and I'm going to click on save changes. And um, you're going to see here, you have a cancel white label site button. You can always cancel it at any time you want. And um, yeah, so now this is configured and I'm going to open my domain. You're going to see here that you have your domain and this is exactly what we just configured. Split um, screen, yeah, with my beautiful background image, my logo and everything. And now your users are going to be able to log in to your white label site. So this was the uh, end of a series of two videos that are going to show you how to handle your white label site. I hope it was uh, informative. And uh, yeah, the next one is going to be about how to handle device types, capabilities and other small tips and tricks on how to use your white label site. And we want to invite you to our coming webinar about our new feature zones, which is an awesome feature that a lot of you were waiting for for a while. And we are very happy to see you there on the 24th of July. And don't forget to subscribe. You, uh, you will find information about it on our website and follow us on LinkedIn to get updates about it. So. I um, am very happy that uh, the next video is coming, so stay tuned and uh, see you there. Bye-bye.